Hello everyone and welcome back to City Bus Manager. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Happy Thursday or oh, whenever you are watching this. And yeah, please do forgive me. I am uh, a little bit sick, but I still want to try and get content out for you all. Because I do appreciate the fact that you still uh, are always there supporting me. So yeah, this is me giving back to you. Even though I'm sick and I should probably be asleep. I've decided to uh, man up and record something for you guys. So um, where do we leave off in the last episode? I can't actually remember where we left off. Um, didn't, didn't we make a new route or something? I think we made a new route. Let's have a look at our routes. That's right, we made the 104. Where does that operate from and to is my next question. You go from rail station to rail station. Okay. And where would that be? I'm pretty sure it's around us somewhere. I, I can't even find it. Huh, where is it? Where's the route? Oh, there we go. Right here. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I remember now. We unlocked York. We unlocked York. So we've got that unlocked. So... That's right, we've got the 104 going down now. I don't I really want to do any changes to that. So I'd like to get this done, improve our company rating, and I do know that we will, to do that, we actually need to, um, yeah, we need to try and improve the travel comfort. Uh, the internet as well would be a good thing, although I don't think we can research. Yeah, WLAN is a little bit out of our reach at the moment. Um, so I'm thinking the only way that we could probably improve would be to get the drivers obviously to level up that'll improve their style ticket prices I don't know why it's saying only four stars I'm pretty sure didn't we lower those yeah we lowered them to the minimum they could go actually so I don't know why they're complaining about that that should be five um, other than that we're looking pretty good it's really the travel comfort and the internet that's letting us down so we'll um we'll go ahead and we'll advance time a bit faster and don't we have a loan outstanding yeah we have one loan outstanding with the interest on it's really good i think that's why i took it in the first place um let's have a look and see what services oh yeah yeah this this 104 is making us a lot look all these buses are full or i've got a lot of people on board um how are you doing Opta solo um you're struggling aren't you yeah, 33 of 55. Um, and that's rush hour, though. Maybe we might need to consider putting all of our large buses on the 104. Because they're all yellow. So they're all very full. Uh, what is the frequency on the 104? Yeah, 30 minutes. Uh, we might have to make this more frequent. Because I don't think 30 minutes is going to cut it. Um, we could always go every 15 minutes during rush hour, but that's only on Monday to Friday. What have we got on a Saturday? It's 30 minutes once again. Um, tell you what, we're going to increase it to every 15 minutes Monday to Friday. Saturdays can go to every 20 minutes, and Sundays can come down to every 40 minutes. So we'll go every half an hour that way there'll be what the first ride will be at 8 a.m last ride will be 8 p.m so we'll confirm that so that will come into effect from tomorrow i do believe that won't be today but yeah the 104 is doing really well for us this is doing extremely well i'm really impressed yes and i know i keep saying it but i still haven't actually managed to get around to doing a livery I, I know i keep saying i will and I, I promise you i will i'll need to make a point of actually taking some time out of my day to make a livery for at least one of our buses because yeah we have the color but they're all plain they've got nothing else on them and yeah i, I do need to do that i really do because otherwise it is it doesn't look very professional does it but yeah, 104 is doing great. Tell you what, let's speed time up a bit here. See if we can get that done. That will give us some extra money. And hopefully the next objective will be a nice, easy one as well. But yeah, that one's going to take a little bit, I think. What have we got here? Lately, you've been having to stand more. Well, I get on the bus earlier then, Matej Pavlovsky. Oh, there we go. Look at 8,800 passengers. Nice. Another easy one. The game must have heard me. 
Okay, so that's doing great. Yeah, all of these routes are our own, so we don't have to pay out anything to anyone else. They're not subsidized or anything like that. But yeah, 104. It's doing really well. I mean, we got a, we got a late bus there. But yeah, look, these are all doing good. What about... The 102 is currently our best route. I mean, look, look, that's already up to 1,000, and it, yeah. Has that unlocked any other research? I don't think so. Although we don't have any money anyway. We were in debt. Um... Yeah. Is there anything we can do? I mean, there's literally nothing. We need more trophies. I think we're kind of stuck in a little bit of a rut. Although we have a shift there. Right, I'm going to give you the Electrolina BV. You can have... Oh, okay, 104. You can take that as well. 102. You can be a 200 MMC. Um... Yeah, I don't really want to take another loan, if I can help it at all. Otherwise, it's just going to put us back and make things harder for us. Um, oh, we've run out of buses. Is there anything on the used market we can buy? Preferably something that's ready to go. Uh, yeah, we can't. <laughs> we can't afford to buy that. I mean, we could offer... There ain't even like an Optair Solo or anything we could buy. There's just nothing... Nothing at all. Oh, goodness. This isn't going well. This is really not going good. Oh, dear. We just need some buses to come back to the depot now, I think. Is there anything coming back? Anything at all? Oh, dearie me. And I've upped the frequency on the 104 tomorrow. Oh, beaver. That wasn't a good thing to do. Uh, is there any buses? I just need... Oh, please accept. Will you take 9,000? Please. They've accepted. Excellent. Right. Oh, and you can go and park in there. Perfect. Right, are you actually serviceable? Wiper, brake pads. Oh, we'll do all of it. Clean, wash, fuel. That probably ain't going to go out now, but it will be serviceable. Oh. Hopefully soon. Um, do we have anything coming back? No, we need a bus to come back. Anything right now. I'll take it. Just something. Oh, I see one come back. Right, go. Oh, what's wrong with you? An indicator. Oh, there we go. Go! <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, this isn't going well. Delayed assignment all over the place. Go. Have a quick clean. Oh, okay, you can't. You're going out. Oh, dearie me. Right. You're going to have to go on to 104, I'm afraid. And you're going to have to go on to 104. Alexandra Dudek. Um, employee details. Uh, go on in. Have some time off. You can go out, you can go out, you can have a clean. Okay. Perfect, so that bus should now be serviceable. And you've just come back into the depot. You can have a quick clean on the inside. Perfect, and you can park there. That is going to be your space. We'll slow down time a minute. And what have we got? Let's have a look and see what your license plate will be. You're an 8.9 meter. Uh, we haven't got any new Enviro's. We've got old Enviro 8.9 meters. Um. Yeah. Uh, you can be. It's a oh, fairly modern. We'll go. Y Y, 18. Uh, Z. R V. There we go. And uh, fleet number you can be uh, have we got fifteen hundred? Oh, that's already assigned. Um Okay, what about four thousand? Nope, that's already assigned, oh dear. Um seventeen fifty? There we go. Perfect. Um once you've done that you can go oh gosh. Right, go. Go. We need one more. Right, go. You can be cleaned and washed. Okay, so hopefully that's all of it. Oh, we're just about managing to maintain service here. Yeah, this is a bit of a struggle. Beaver's bit off more than he can chew. Right, um, you can go clean, wash, fuel. Nice. Oh, okay, we do have more research. Nice, that's free. That's free. Excellent. 
Okay, always nice research when it's free. Okay, you, my friend, can go and have a paint. What was that? I don't like... Well, then don't get on my bus. It's really simple. If you don't like to ride my bus, don't get on it. It's really simple logic. Oh, look at that. Part of it was already painted in the right colour. Nice. Okay, so that bus is actually now serviceable, which is good. Is there any more buses? We'll slow down time again. Well, we have a broken bus. Which one is it? It is the one that we've sent out. Okay. Oh, that's already been... Can I? No, I can't. Right. Anything that's... Ooh, what have we got here? 8.9. I will offer you 12. You've accepted. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, traffic control. You got caught driving. We... Come on, I expect more from you, Meta Davis. You can have a pay cut of £1.30 an hour and I will pay that penalty. Right. We need another parking space. Put two down, just in case. There we go. Okay, clean, wash, fuel. And we'll just get those all repaired and that bus will be ready for service. 104, uh, 59, 47. Well, it's going to have to be an Enviro 200 MC then for that. Bartolomej Weber is going to be driving. Yeah, the 104, it's going to make us a lot of money. I can already see. I mean, look, it, it's already caught up. And it's already our second most popular route. And soon it's going to catch up with the 102. Okay, we did actually fail some shifts. I think that's because the bus didn't go out in time. Which route? Oh, it was the 100. I'm not really bothered about that. It's the 104 I'm most worried about. Because that's what's earning us the money. So that's the one I'm trying to prioritise buses for. yeah looks like things are going well on that route we just need to try and keep up in terms of actual bus availability uh, 104 don't have any buses okay research has come been completed nice um right are you yes you're going to be repaired have I got any no I don't have any buses oh dear oh dear Right, oh, come on, I need this to go up. That's really holding us back right now. Okay, do we have any available buses? Yes. Right, go. Right, you're going to have to go out of out of repaint. I just need you to go out. And you can be... Oh, what was it? Why, why was it YY18? Put that there for now. I'm pretty sure it was YY18. Wait, what? We'll pause the game quick. I just want to see buses. It's going to be a mini bus, isn't it? There it is. YY. Oh, that's an old one. Tell you what. We'll change that to YY14. Then we'll go RWP. There we go. I'm pretty sure we do have some of those ready, don't we? Yes, YX14 CDT. Tell you what. I'm going to change it again. You're going to be YX14CT. CTD? I'm losing the plot here. CDT. Okay, so CDS. CDS. And you will be fleet number 1502. There we go. Right. Advanced time. Really fast. Perfect, and you can go straight out into service. There we are. Right, anything else? 102, what's wrong with you? Oh, you're already taken, and you're already taken. Okay. Well, at least we've got that 104 out and assigned. Yes. Very good, very good. Well, I'm worried that we're going to struggle with the Monday to Friday service on that 104. I'm thinking... You can go there. We need to get in another bus if possible. That one's broken, but we fixed when it returns. Uh, I'll offer you 9,500. They've accepted. Good. 
Good, 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 good. This is really good. Really good. We're getting buses for cheap. You can go over there, my friend. And you will be Y X14 D D T. Nope, that's already signed. Was it C D S C D T C D U? And you will be your fifteen oh two. It'll be fifteen oh three. Perfect. Okay, right, we do have buses returning. 102, I'll just go take the BEV. Why not? That one can go. Uh, you can go on there. Right, go. Go, go, go. Right, you can have a wash on the inside. Yeah, just go. Just go. Right. Oh, you're the one that's needing a repair, aren't you? You clean a wash. Clean. Wash. Uh, clean and wash. Okay, we've got loads of buses coming back now. Clean and wash. And you... We don't have any parts. I can repair the oil on it, I guess. So repair the oil. Replace the oil. It's more like it. Um, so you're being repaired. No, nope. you're being re-oiled. Get it right in a minute. Are you actually serviceable? Can I send you out? Well, we'll tell you what, we'll give you a paint. How about that? So yeah, we're getting ready for Sunday service now. Oh look, we're going up 2.7. Oh come on, please go up a little bit more. Oh, right. 407897, there we go. Perfect. Paint. Go. Right. I want to make sure I can't repair you at the moment. Uh, let's have a look for replacement parts. Five brake pads. Delivery is at 9am. That's okay. 2149. 23.67. 23.83. Okay, we can't afford that. So what if I quickly do that? Our oh, money is virtually falling. So what we'll just go with that. Oh, we went up a bit. 25. Now we'll go with that. There we go. Perfect. Right, so they'll be delivered at 9 a.m. Then we can get that bus ready for service. Right, why have you not been repaired? You should have been. I, I put you on the list to get repaired. There is indicators there. Okay, where are my mechanics? Where have you gone? No idea what's going on. Oh, there we go. There we go. Cool. Right, so that one's being cleaned. That one's being repaired. Excellent. Clean. Wash, repair, you can have a new set of wipers. You can be cleaned on the inside. All our buses upgrade with Wi-Fi. Not Wi-Fi, air conditioner. Most of them should be. Okay, so how much is that gonna cost? 1700. Okay, you need a part wiper, okay. You can get cleaned, you can get cleaned. You go and have a paint. Clean and wash for you. Clean, wash, and a indicator replacement. Okay. Looks like this one may have come from London. There we are. Put it into Beaver Group Blue. Excellent. I'll make sure all these are ready for service. You'll be done tomorrow. Oh, you can have a quick clean on the inside. Yeah, so we are looking pretty good for Sunday's service. 
Um, you're being cleaned on the outside and repaired. Excellent. Nice, so we're getting all our buses in. Oh, Innis Green is very happy. Excellent, I'm glad to hear it. Now, I don't get why this bus, the BEV, hasn't been repaired. Some the mechanics gone on strike or something? Are they sleeping? Okay, BEV is on the way to the bus wash. So bus wash then repair, I guess? You moved it. Well, you move. See, the funny thing is, is that normally in the UK, the bus stops aren't really managed by the bus companies. It's normally done by a local council, so that technically isn't realistic. But hey, it's the way the game works. Okay, can I time jump now? No. What about now? There we go. Right, 102. Oh, can I skip a little bit more? There we go. Oh, we did something. Oh, yes, we did the company rating. Excellent. That is good to see. 104. 104. 104. 101. 104. 104. 101. 100. Oh, no, I didn't want to send you out, did I? Oh, it won't hurt. Hopefully that bus will make it round. Right, what have we got here? Repair times by 10%. Oh, I'll take that. Why not? What have we got now? Okay. Cool, cool. So 25 passengers in one day. That's not going to be possible today, I don't think. But on a Monday, that should be more than doable. Right, 100. Passenger numbers are going to be lower on a uh, Sunday. So we can probably send out the lower capacity buses for today's services. So yeah, the 104 has increased to an every half hourly service on a Sunday. Yeah, it should earn us some money, so it's probably a good good thing to do. So yeah, it was a nice bonus that we managed to get that improve the rating done in this episode. That was a good bonus. I'm happy with that. Um Yeah, so we'll get that research done. Nice. Look at that. The 103. Why are you busy? That's the 101. They're less frequent on Sunday, aren't they? That's probably why. 104 doing it what it normally does, which is get busy. Nice. So how are we still losing money? That's a bit of a concern. Well, look, we did well. We made more money. We made that's the most money we've ever made, I think, in a day. Yeah, look, we've done really well. So yeah, things are on the up by the looks of it. Um, investments are going down. Tickets, nice. Ticket revenue is increasing. Good, good. I don't really want another loan. Really, don't want to do that. Yeah, how are our other routes doing? Let's see if we can have a look. So we've got the 101. It's a 101. Is there anything? Does this route not operate? A 102? Does that not operate on a Sunday? Okay, well, for some reason, that lot didn't go out. Maybe that's because I didn't sign a bus in time. Um, well, that's not good, is it? But yeah, people buying weekly tickets. That's good. That's good. Tell you what, this will be a good one to get done as well. That 38,064 trophies. That will actually unlock a quite, quite a few things for us, I believe. So that'll be, what, 150? Yeah, that, that's going to do us good. We'll clean you on the inside and wash you on the outside. Just want to make sure there's other buses I haven't missed. Uh, you can go for a fuel. And uh, what about you? You're all good. Nice. So it's literally that one bus that we missed. Excellent. You know what? I 
never thought that the uh, service center would be open on a Sunday. Normally that would be closed. It would be good if we could set this like we do with the um, timetable schedule. So we can say Monday to Sunday or Monday to Saturday even. You know, 8 till 5 and then Sunday is closed. Because yeah, that would actually be a thing. Like in the UK, they wouldn't be open on a Sunday and on Saturday they'd only be open for about 3 or 4 hours. So... Yeah, that's quite odd, the fact that that's open. Anyway, we'll have to deal with it. Oh, nice, look. Money is going up. See, so, yeah, I'm a little concerned. We'll have to see how tomorrow goes. Because I up the frequency. And, um, yeah. Not sure how that's going to pan out. Any used buses? Why? What's, what's wrong with you? All oh, right, yeah, you're right. Tell you what, when you get back, you can have all that fixed. How about that? Ooh. Can't even offer. Okay. 104. 104. 101. 100 can be Optair Solo. Yeah, I'm worried that 102 is not operating at all. Oh dear, there's loads of people waiting, and I'm betting that only had like one bus on it or something and it didn't get sent out. Oh my goodness. They're all going to probably create, like, this bus company is horrible. Yeah, is there anything for the 102? Yeah, we need an additional bus, like, on the 102. Hey, what? That's a good idea, actually. Um. Can I do that from here? I click on there. I mean, there's a way to insert an additional bus. I didn't think it was there. Bus stops, buses, there. Eh, bus routes. There we go, insert additional bus. Um, I'm going to send out you. There we go. You weren't doing anything, so you can go and service the 102. Hopefully that'll fix that problem with loads of passengers waiting, because yeah, there are quite a few waiting. Oh. BEV is back. You can be cleaned on the inside. Yeah, 104 is getting crowded. I mean, I don't know what we can do apart from up the up the frequency because we don't have double decker buses yet. Like, what is even the research for a double decker bus? Uh, twenty thousand. Yeah, we just can't do it. Although that's e buses, still twenty thousand. And yeah, that's not good. That might be an objective that we'll have to consider for the next episode is double decker buses for the 104 because it is really struggling. I mean, yeah, I could just keep throwing extra frequency at it and more buses, but we're then just going to end up in the same spot. And yeah, we'll have to, you know, there'll be a point where that route's running every five minutes, which is just not good, you know. If we can put a double-decker bus out, we could probably cut the frequency back to every 20 minutes or something. You know, that's on a Sunday, that's every half hour, and it's still getting busy. We, yeah, that route definitely is going to be the first route, I think, to get double-decker buses, because it, it would definitely get the use out of them, that's for sure. But yeah, getting this done, that will enable us to do that. I mean, what's the biggest bus that we can actually buy at the moment in terms of capacity? It is the Kite Electroliner with 85 passengers. I mean, we already have, what, three of those. Uh, yeah, I, sadly, I can't throw the, all three of them out. I mean, we wouldn't have enough to completely operate the 104 with just BEVs. It would be nice if we could, but it's just not going to happen. We just don't have enough of them. I'll go on in, Jake. Have a break.
But yeah, I have a feeling that'll be a piece of cake on Monday. If we're getting 8,000 passengers on a Sunday, that, yeah, that'll be quite easily doable, I think. Um, as will that one. That will be doable. 460 tours. Right, how are we doing? I'll make sure these are all good. So yeah, we've... Oh, you can have a clean and a wash. Um... Thirteen thousand. Well, I used. Oh, that's twenty-three two. I tell you what. There's a cheap loan that I can get. And there's not. I know I said I wasn't going to do it, but one point. See, that's just for one bus, though. Is it really worth it? Yes, that's 14,000 below the price that it would be new. But other than that, I see, I want to get it, but that would mean having to get another loan, which is something that I really don't want to do at all. I'd rather avoid that at all costs. Okay, you need a clean wash. What's wrong with you? Can I have a light? There we go. Okay, if something is... Yeah, thank you. I appreciate it, Johan Morel. That's very nice of you. Okay, so we've got all the buses coming back into the depot now. We'll make sure we get them all ready for Monday morning. House of 104. Yep, it is now officially our best earning route. That doesn't surprise me at all. It is just shot past the 100, the 101 and the 102. Yeah, it's just absolutely crazy. I think we've stumbled onto a winner there, guys. With that 104. I'm telling you. I know I keep saying it, but yeah, it, it will definitely help us out, that's for sure. Maybe we'll have to look at, I don't know, a 105 or something around York. Although, that may not actually be a bad idea. If I open up the map, Pause the time quick. So the 104 operates into York. If we could do like either a 104A or a 105 that did a similar route, but like took a slightly different variation, like maybe through Osbaldwick, maybe to take a bit of load off the 104. I mean, we could try it. Uh, uh, eh, we'll give it a go. It's may not work out the best we'll go it'll be the one oh we'll go 105 um so yeah in york it's gonna have to follow the same route as the 104 and then you can go can you go that way yes i hate that color that's really not visible that nice orange there we go uh, and then we can go nunnery lane victoria bar uh, can we go go this way maybe we go Howard Street and we'll go maybe put another one there Cemetery Road Willis Street Heslington Road the Retreat Thief Lane then we'll just meet back up with the 104 and we'll follow these stops hopefully that will help us out a bit 104 terminates here doesn't it Eden's Court yeah doesn't it terminate or go down here and then turn around Come back. Um, I'll tell you what, you can go down there. Can you go in there? Yes, you can. Perfect. Excellent. There we are. Uh, 
Okay, you're doing that again, aren't you? Right, Badger Walk, can you please go there? Thank you. And Deramore Drive can be there. Excellent. Yeah, I don't know why it does that. But it does. There we go. Okay, we'll throw another stop in there. And we've got Cemetery Road. Howard Street. S. Crick Terrace, Fuster Way. Then we've got Nunnery Lane, Victoria Bar. Nunnery Lane Car Park. Um. Right. Can you, like, go down there? And can you stop at Station Road, then Rail Station? Perfect. Okay. So how's that route going to do? Yeah, that's not bad. Um, tell you what. We'll go for every half an hour. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> putting it down every half an hour. The passenger load just goes through the roof. Um... Yeah, we're going to have to go every half an hour, and that'll be Monday to Friday. It'll be 5 till 10. We'll have a Saturday-only service at 5 till 9, and that'll be every half an hour as well. So we need to check this and make sure that we put in the destinations. Now, where would be the turnaround? Panham Grove? And you want a five minute wait. Where's Canham Grove? There. We'll give you five minutes there. Copy that. Paste that. And that is going to be Canham Grove. There we go. And we need another one. Paste you. Okay, and this is going to be Sunday only. And we're going to go. 7 till 8 every hour. And that'll be fine. We don't want that. We'll activate it now. Excellent. Excellent, excellent. Right. Hopefully that will work in tandem with the 104. And uh, take a little bit of passenger load off it. It runs a slightly varied route from York. It goes around here, which is what I was wanting to do. And then from from basically here, from Matama House, is that? It's hard to read. Yeah, then it follows, and the, 10, the 104 goes around there. The 105 actually goes up into Roger Kirk Center and does a loop around there. So, yeah, it does have a little bit of difference to the 104, which is hopefully... Uh, gonna help us out, but yeah, we have actually gone over time a little bit for this episode, so I uh, do hope that you enjoyed that episode of City Bus Manager. If you did, please don't forget to leave a like, and if you are new around here and you want to see more content just like that, then consider subscribing. But that is gonna be it from me, and until the next episode, take care.